Hey, get up. What are you? What an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Babes Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. <laughs> That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! <laughs> See? The word is, you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. <laughs> Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On a tractor? <laughs> cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay. Stay there, come down. Alright, let's check. Um, okay, first. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Um, nah, no, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. So you tell me you do not have a boat. Please do Oh. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. No, See you. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Hey there, girls. What do you do? I really do not want to know about You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. <laughs> oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, isn't it? You've been here for three days? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? 
I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Let's go check on. Um, um, Let's go on. 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 Hey, Lee. Mm -hmm. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Okay. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Gosh, wow. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one, maybe, if it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon, I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. Maybe not. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No <laughs> problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the bar. So I'm guessing his dad knows I knows that he's going to jail. I think she does. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until the boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Well, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. <laughs> Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Can I give you a piece of advice? Uh, sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. 
Go! I'll get my gun! stitch you up. It can't do that. It almost, it almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I... He uh... died? Piece of shit, let him die. Um. I wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger, or your friends aren't cowards. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. Oh. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Look! Um. Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Fuck! How do you get trapped? <laughs> 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 Take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. 
When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. It could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. <sighs> what is it? I, I have to pee. Seriously? I'd go out there again in a second. Um, I bet you would. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You yeah. have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a oh fuck. My God. fuck. I'm sorry We're in a war zone. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He is not bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. Chop? We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop what? him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm him down. We reason with him. At the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. What? Nobody threatens my boy. I am not sorry. Everyone, me. chill the fuck out. Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, see. and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's, He's not bitten. bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. <laughs> upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. It, it's Larry, team. right? But Man, this is his son. Look around, dumbass. I got a daughter in here. You got a daughter in here. Get your head out of your ass, boy. We've all got people in here. We can figure this out without killing anybody. There's another way. Yeah, with a shovel. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Just worry about duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's oh, just God. locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just yes, looking out are. for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then... When she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast, and then there'll be three. Then we deal with it then, but right now we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it, because that boy is bitten. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. 